Hello guys today we are going to see a video of how to save and open files in swings. First create a class next thing to find a package now we need some import statement says we writing in swings we need to import swings package then for performing events we need to import event package now extend a frame class and implement action listener interface for class D. Now create menus and name them as file edit and help we need to place menu in menu bar so create menu bar and add menus to the menu bar and set bounds to menu bar as 0, 0, 0048530 then add menu bar to frame next create menu items i1 i2 i3 and i4 and name them as open save about and help respectively. Then create text area and add action listener to items open and save create a method action performed with arguments as action event e then in the if type as follows and create an object for file keys or class. And store open log which is used to show files in your system an integer variable then store the files path and string variable named file path then in try block create an object for buffer adredder class and then using while loop you read the data in the selected file to the text area then close the file this is the way of opening your file in web page. Later if you click on save option then you file need to be saved for this in the try block create a file reader class object store the text in text tria and string variable and write it in the file and later close the file word a catch block to catch an exception if occurred then in the main method call the constructor. Do not forget to give file path by giving drive name and file reader class. And for file IO operations we need a package called IO package so define it also. Ok let's run this application now. We have created action listeners for items open and save so click on open then you will see this thing displayed on your screen. We can only open txt extension file so choose the particular file and click on open. Then the data in the file is displayed in the text area on your screen. Ok now we run the application again and now type anything in the text area. After typing in the text area just click on the option save and then the file will be saved. Let's check whether the file is really saved or not. First go to the particular drive which you have mentioned and the drive named as first is created in your drive or not. I have saved my file as first in the H drive. And there it's the file is successfully created. Thanks for watching the video like share and subscribe.